I guess I'll call this the pain tour. Watching these last few videos have put me in a lot of pain. Thank you for trying, but I'm sorry. It's fallen on deaf ears. You are just one woman who is tired of seeing the same old shit. We need more than a meeting place. We need closure. We need to understand that we are on an island by ourselves and no one's gonna help us. It's like fucking Gilligan's Island. You don't wanna go over there where the natives are because they're headhunters. You just wanna stay in your little fucking pocket. Me, you, the professor, the skipper too. We don't want to be around those black people. Those blacks. And the funny part about those blacks, those blacks are all under 35 years old and they make us look bad. Sergeant Willie Pete started a lot of shit. But he didn't do that in a manner towards he wanted to hurt anybody. He wanted to enlighten people on what he saw. And in saying that, he was empowered enough for enough people to see things the way he saw them for them to be some spinoffs and shit. And these little spinoffs have got to me. You got women talking about how stupid and how dumb black men are and how much they want this white cock and not black dick. You can't do it all by yourself, baby. You can't do it with a black man helping you, apparently. Cause black man ain't no good no more. We ain't good for nothing. And I don't even know why I'm commenting on your video. You're trying to to, to say you know it's alright we can build a new us now in building a new us we don't want none of them then how would that be that would be worse than us riding through at night through the neighborhood You go through the old neighborhood and you see them out in the street. You take aim on them. That's what it would take. We'd have to kill a whole bunch of our own people in order to be free from this bullshit. Because you can't reprogram a fucked up, mixed up kid. You can't reprogram a group of people who would rather listen to a 50 cent record grabbing their dick, having some hoe suck their dick and all that good old bullshit. You, you can't reprogram people who have been placed into the pop culture as icons. Gangster. I'm a gangster, bitch. You can't change that man. He has been reprogrammed to the point to where he don't give a fuck about you and especially don't give a fuck about me. You're just a piece of meat and I'm just in his fucking way. I can't kill my people to be free. And it's gonna come down to some old stupid shit like that. We can't fix it by talking. Action speaks louder than words. It's time to tell these people, you know what, you hang out there, you might make money selling crack, but you're killing your mama, you're killing your uncle, you're killing your cousin, you're killing your people. Fuck you. I hope your crack melts in your goddamn pocket and you'll make 15 goddamn cents. And then, he gonna buy another batch of powder from the Mexican or the white boy. Then he gonna go right back out to the street and he gonna kill some more black people. Now I'm gonna say something. It's wrong what I used to do. I 
Maybe this is like a confession for me these last few videos. But when I sold dope, I didn't sell no dope to anybody black. I wouldn't sell any dope to anybody black. And for that, I was called police. You the police or something, nigga. All these white people come to your house, Mexicans come up here buying dope from you. How come they don't come to us? Because you fucking rob them. You, you beat them up and try to attack them. So I wouldn't, I wouldn't sell any dope to anybody black. But I would exploit the women. I was wrong. That manipulate families and shit with it. I was wrong. And I hate what I did now. Because look at this shit. Everybody that I hear talking bad about us is from that generation underneath me. My kids. My people have self-destructed to the point to where it's the clan don't have to march no more. The skinheads don't have to fuck with us. In the end, they might have to put on those biohazard suits to clean our carcasses up off the fucking streets because we're fucking killing each other every goddamn day and don't nobody care about it. This is it for me. I just want the world to see that people do have feelings. People do feel for other people. I'm living pretty goddamn good even though I haven't done shit for fucking a year. This hurts. It hurts to see black people have lost. Martin Luther King walked around for nothing. Malcolm X was shot by another black man for nothing. That's why Jesse Jackson didn't get big in it. He ain't fucking stupid. I can tell the truth right now and be dead next week. Where I can just play with the truth. Maybe somebody will wake up and feel it. That's why they call Al Sharp Tongue. So thank you for your apology. You made one person feel good. That's me. But it ain't on you to apologize. It's on your mama. Your grandmama. It's on that white girl down the street that took that black man from somebody. It's on everybody but you because you see. People can't see anymore. The struggle has been lost. In the final days, the battle has been lost. There is no more freedom for black people in America. We're slaves to Nintendos, Xboxes, crack cocaine, and smoking weed, parties, to hip the hop. We are slaves by our own devices. I just want to say thank you for your video. Spot a little bit of shit out. Let people know how I feel. Somebody shouldn't have pointed these videos out to me. Knowing I'm soft inside. Knowing that I would melt down. Thank you. I'm finna go cuss out Willie Pete in a minute. Because if I don't go all the way around. I can't leave. If the circle's still open. So, you keep teaching your kids if you have any. I hope you don't. We're all about to be slaves, and we're going to be slaving right next to white people and Mexicans. All that we've ever fought for was a fucking joke. All that we ever believed in was a lie. All that we ever dreamed of was just a fucking dream. And the reality is this. If there is no tomorrow, then we die happy today. But if tomorrow comes and there's no happiness, don't cry tomorrow. Because we let today slip by. Thank you.